a mini pecker right here. We need to get back to one more fireball. Oh my gosh, no, this is gonna be too close. Y'all see me flying, never drop down, drop down, smoking higher. Right, I'm another match here up against Lucas. So we got Roll Hogs in our starting hand. We're gonna go split Roll Hogs right here. Tank for that fire spear. Definitely don't want to take 300 damage for no reason. This looks like it's gonna be a fast hog cycle with the. It's gonna have um, the cannon and the archer queen. Very interesting. Gonna go with four row recruits to deal with the archer queen, and which I really think is warranted. And that's gonna be pretty good. They're gonna clean it up uh, for one elixir. That's pretty good value on our opponent's end. He goes with roll delivery on the right side, and he's pretty much back to. Uh, roll hogs. So we're gonna split skeleton dragons. We're not too worried about this. We're gonna go ice spirit. Tank for his fire spirit. Definitely don't want to take that shot if we don't need to. And let's get geared up for another of his push. So we do have a uh, monk, which is gonna be really good against his archer queen. The monk ability is gonna absolutely shut down the archer queen. We're gonna go fireball right here. We're gonna go barbarian barrel. We're gonna use the monk ability right now. I was really hoping to wait a little bit longer. Um, but, you know, wait until we get uh, closer to past the bridge. But it is what it is. So, Monk's gonna force out another log. And our opponent is not able to get to our tower yet, so we're gonna go split Roll Hogs again, force out the cannon. And that's exactly what I was thinking that he had. So he's got Earthquake as well, but which is gonna be essentially useless, more or less, to him. Um, because we don't have any buildings. So, pretty even match thus far and not much I can really do. So, gonna keep my Ice Spear in hand. And I'm gonna go Roll Recruits. I'm actually gonna take some uh, damage there. I definitely could have gone Fireball uh, with Ice Spirit, but not too bad. So, we're gonna go with uh, Skeleton Dragons right here. We're gonna use the Monk ability. And I think we should be okay here. So, Monk should get in front of the... Oh wow, okay, that's very well played. We're gonna use the Monk ability, we're gonna go Roll Hogs right now. And we're gonna go Mini P.E.K.K.A. And we're gonna go Barbarian Barrow, so that should help clean things up quicker. And we should get a couple Hogs onto the tower. Wow, that's really well uh, played de defense on our opponent's end. We're gonna go Skeleton Dragons right here. I'm expecting him to go Archer Queen. So we're gonna go Fireball and force everything back and that allows our mini P.E.K.K.A to almost get a shot off and Skeleton Dragons do get a few hits off and we're not too worried about that Archer Queen anymore. So we're gonna get ready for Hog, some Roll Hogs, no? Okay, we'll drop Monk in front then, we'll definitely take that. We're gonna use the Monk ability now, perfect timing. Have a tank and finish up the cannon for us which is gonna be really good. Monk ability still going on, so he has to wait a little bit for the log. We have so much on his tower, he cycles back to another um, cannon, but that's not going to be enough. Wow, okay, we're going to fireball this, and we're just going to barbar uh, bar barrel. Just finish everything up, definitely don't want to be dealing with any of that stuff right now. And now the good part is we can reset and go with um, roll recruits in the back. He did end up wasting that. Uh, fire spear, which I'm kind of surprised from him because he's been playing really well so far. Um, so we're going to use the monk ability right now. And we're going to go with mini P.E.K.K.A right here. And let's see, I don't think we're going to end up giving up too much. And we're going to go fireball right now. And I should be able to clean everything up. We have Ro recruits da dashing on that tower. Oh my gosh. And that is going to be good game well played against Lucas. Wow, such good game. Let's hop onto another one here. We'll start off with Royal Recruit since our opponent doesn't want to do anything. And this is always a safe bet to go. Inferno Dragon. Definitely going to be interesting. Could be Balloon. Could be Lava Hound. Never know. So I'll let it play out. See what he drops there on the left side. Uh, Lumberjack. Definitely feel like it's going to be some sort of Balloon deck. Definitely, definitely. Looks like it could be a Balloon deck. So yeah, especially with the Bowler. Definitely looking like it's going to be a balloon deck. So, what we're going to do here, we're going to wait a bit. We're going to go Ice Spirit for the... We're not going to use the Punk ability right there, because that's really going to set us up for her failure by activating King Towers. I've had that happen to myself way too many times. Definitely don't want that happening again. He gets a good King Tower activation. Not too bad. Actually, it could be um, Graveyard too. Very interesting here. 
Well, it is Balloon, as uh, I initially suspected. So go with Ice Beard here. And I think Boulder's going to get probably a couple shots off on the right side. Yeah, unfortunate. It is what it is. And Skeleton Dragons are essentially useless for the rest of the time. So, all right. So it's going to be a Balloon deck. He's got Infernal Dragon, Baby Dragon, uh, Bowler. This deck definitely does struggle get, um, into this. But we'll see what we can make happen here. So, against that, we're going to split Royal Recruits. Definitely don't have anything great. Got to save the Skeleton Dragons for the um, for the Balloon. So, I go Monk right here. Let's see what else he's got. I'm pretty sure he's going to use his uh, Lumberjack. We're going to use the Monk ability right... Oh, wow, that was so well played by our opponent right there. Man, that was so good. That's... A pretty big turning point actually for us unfortunately for the um for the worse just because of how things um, are gonna play out ice beer right there hopefully finish up the um baby dragon which it does balloon doesn't get a shot off which is really nice for us and we're gonna go roll hogs here immediately on the left side right here so let's see what he does he goes with lumberjack definitely not too worried about that we're gonna go with monk of our own right here and should be pretty good here pretty good defense i'd say um, I'm gonna go with Royal Recruits, and we gotta be able to tank for the Baby Dragon too, which is, I think, more of our main focus. I'm gonna go uh, Ice Spirit right here. Oh my gosh, okay, so he goes to Freeze. So, not too bad, we're gonna Fireball this, and it should be pretty good. So, we definitely wanted the Skeleton Dragon to turn around and start working on the Inferno Dragon as soon as possible. We're not that far behind, but we're definitely not doing that great either. We'll go Monk right here. I think that should get into Boulder range if I use the Monk ability. I think it's gonna turn around nice. That's really good for us, but he is cycling really quickly. So we'll go uh, Skeleton Dragons right here. Pretty sure he's gonna hit us with a free. He's gonna go with uh, Ice Spirit. That should buy us a little bit of time. I'm gonna go uh, Firewall, and I think that's not gonna be enough to finish us finish our tower, tower off, but it's pretty dang close. So, wow, this is this is really close. Uh, we really got to get back to a monk. And they're going to use our monk right here. And they're going to use the monk ability. I think that should be able to kick those things back. I don't really know. Going to use the uh, mini pecker right here. We need to get back to one more fireball. Oh my gosh, no, this is going to be too close. Oh, he's going to get it just like that. 66 hit points left, well played, just like that. So a lot of these games are going to be really close. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time.